a heartbreaking story of a two-year-old boy found beaten to death, and now police say someone has admitted to this awful crime. The mother's boyfriend is now charged with taking that child's life. Fox 2's Kelly Hoskins joins us live from Clayton after talking with the top prosecutor in this case. Kelly? Well, Manny and Vic authorities charged 25-year-old Dewan Loughton with neglect and child abuse. They say it resulted in the child's death. They say it's been a rough time for everyone involved. Charges have been filed against 25-year-old Dewan Loudon after a toddler's death. Investigators say the two-year-old boy was found dead inside a home in the 3200 block of Cross Keys Drive, Tuesday, February the 1st. Uh, these are always cases that are just going to, you know, they, 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 they're going to hit home a little harder. Loudon is accused of grabbing and punching the two-year-old boy. The police say the boy was the son of Loudon's girlfriend. If you are one that feels like you might... Um, um, harm a child, you need to get help uh, because once you cross that line, there's going to be consequences and, and we fully anticipate this, this defendant um, having serious consequences. A prosecutor say he admitted to the crime and confessed to hitting the boy multiple times. The St. Louis Crisis Nursery wants families to know its doors are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. It's horrific. It's just awful. It just breaks my heart to hear that another little one in our community has died when there is help available. St. Louis Crisis Nursery is one of those places where people can call 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and, and what some people don't know is it's free. It doesn't cost anything. It really is the right thing to do. The organization provides a short-term safe haven for thousands of children a year whose families face an emergency caused by illness, homelessness, domestic violence, or overwhelming parental stress. Well, St. Louis Crisis Nursery says that if you know anyone overwhelmed with children, they should seek help. And you can find that 24-hour help hotline right there on your screen. We will also have that information on our website. Reporting live from Clayton, Kelly Hoskins, Fox 2 News.